Hey guys, how's it going? I got one more package here on September 2nd, 2020, and I'm going to share that with you now. Oh, let's see here. Okay. I ordered this like a week or two ago. I didn't know how long it was going to take here to get here. Um, it's from eBay, and uh, if you've seen my unpackaging videos before, you probably get a good idea what this is going to be because of the package. But, um, it's obviously an ancient scroll, right? <laughs> Some kind of papyrus. Now, this is kind of something that I've wanted for a while, that I've had an idea of wanting to get, and, uh, I guess something possessed me to get it. But I think, really because, um, I'm recording videos in the bedroom here, and I've got posters and stuff in the living room, and I thought about putting a little bit in here, and I thought this would be a really cool poster because I've talked about it a little bit recently but I definitely want to talk about it a lot more but anyways we'll cut the crap and let's try to open this up I'm probably just gonna peel this apart I don't know what the official way to open these things is but they're usually in there so tight anyway let's just peel it apart if I can okay that might not work exactly like I thought it would one of these things always gonna be a pain in the butt Mm. Okay, you can see it down in there. Uh, seems like the video could be getting a little laggy. Hope it doesn't record like that. I do have the knife with me. I can get it started. Ooh, okay. Now we can really peel that back. Okay. I'm going to try to hang this up in the video, too. I, I might move it around. I don't know, but... What do you think it is? I hope it looks good. I think that it will. Hmm. Let's see. This looks like the bottom of it. I ordered a pretty decent size. Eraser head. And David Lynch. It's kind of a standard size poster. I think I'm going to put it over here by the TV. For now, I don't know how great this will be, but and it's kind of a strange setup in here, especially with the door. And I could always put it on the door and just get rid of the the coat rack and put that somewhere else in the closet or something. Maybe I don't know. I might want to put it on the door. I thought about putting it up here because it would be seen pretty pretty good. But yeah, it's definitely one of my favorite movies. I love David Lynch, and there's no movie really like Eraserhead. It's very significant. So, I don't know. And even if it was like right around here, it wouldn't be too bad. I've got a lot of other, I thought about doing more film posters in here, and uh, I've already got some other stuff that came with DVDs and such that I could put up, so I might, I'm just going to tack it to the wall. But this is a really good print, so... I might have to, if I want to get some more posters that are kind of unique, film posters, and I might have to order from this place again. And it didn't take too long. I started, started to worry a little bit that it was going to take forever, but... Okay. Yeah. How's that? 
<laughs> Sweet. I love it. That's good. Very cool. All right. How many other YouTubers have you seen with eraser head posters in the background? Along with the good old Trump banner. <laughs> so, I've, yeah, I've got a lot of other stuff to put up. Um, I've got some stuff just around the corner on my table that I've been wanting to put up, but I'm just not sure how I was going to do it. I don't know if I was going to put it in the living room or not. show you some just to make this video a little more interesting too there were some little things um, some that came with the Alfred Hitchcock collection some of uh, the covers of his movies vertigo and uh, anyone could become obsessed with the past with a background like that vertigo got the birds it says I keep telling you this isn't a few birds there are goals crows swifts I remember watching that movie in school a long time ago it's awesome rear window why would a man leave his apartment three times on a rainy night with a suitcase and come back three times we got north by northwest it says, now you listen to me. I'm an advertising man, not a red herring. I've got a job, a secretary, a mother, two ex-wives, and several bartenders that depend upon me, and I don't intend to disappoint them all by getting myself slightly killed. And of course, there's Psycho. We all go a little mad sometimes. Okay. Now the Predator Blu-ray set came with move, uh, pictures from the Predator 2, the new one, the Predator. That's my new suit, Bubba. It's got quotes from the movies, too. Uh, predators. Now let's find a way off this effing planet. We got the original Predator with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Get to the chopper. And then Predator 2. And uh, it says, want some candy? So those are cool. They wouldn't really show up all that great, I guess. But I've been thinking about putting them around the doorways or something. I don't know if I want to put them in the living room or in here. Or if I thought about getting some kind of frames for them. And I've also got these uh, that came from that special Final Fantasy VII remake. The Walmart Special Edition. We've got Cloud, Sephiroth, Ares. And then we've also got Barrett. Antifa. So, and then the, the remake at that. So, what about putting these up too? But uh, I've also got a Shredder poster that came with the movie Shredder, the Blu ray. Not Shredder from Ninja Hurls, but it's a horror movie Shredder. And uh, there's probably others that are in some of my games or movies that I'll have to go through. But anyway. That's a cool eraser head poster. It's unbelievable. Something that I've kind of wanted for a while. Just to just because I like the movie so much, I always thought it would be cool to have an eraser head poster. Something that, you know, you're not generally just gonna walk into a store and find. It's gonna have to be like special ordered. But uh I love it, so alright, thanks for watching guys. God bless.